What is going on, you beautiful human beings? It is good to see you. Thank you so very much for tuning in. Today, we are going back to a game that we've been really enjoying lately. I think you guys have been too. Uh, a game called Definitely Not Fried Chicken. Maybe today. We only have about two hours today because I slept in and I, I sat there looking at my Steam library. Couldn't figure out what I wanted to play. It was either this or uh, a return to, what do you call it, um, uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Because right now we're kind of in a lull of an area. Uh, there's not very many new games coming out that I want to really play. Uh, so we're kind of stuck with this one for now. Well, not stuck with. I'm actually enjoying this. But this is a game uh, we've been really enjoying. There's... Oh, what else have we really been playing? A little bit of Overwatch has been a lot of fun. But for the most part, I really didn't, uh, really didn't enjoy a lot of uh, recent games at the moment. So we're kind of in this lull of trying to figure out what to, what to play. Uh, so here we are. I'm looking forward to giving this just another shot. And seeing what we can do. There was another game. Like, there's games coming out that I'm kind of looking forward to trying. Uh, we'll see how it goes. But, all right. Let's get a sense of where we're at again. Big restaurant. Hogwarts Legacy. I mean, I might try it. Uh, the gameplay that I've seen others play doesn't look like something that I want to play. But let me look into it more. I need something. All right. Let's look at our map real quick. Uh, that's the only one to deliver to at the moment. All right, let's get back into the swing of things and how this works. Uh, okay, so you guys are doing these. So you go here and you go here. Let's go back to our other business. Let's go back to our factory and see how we're doing on our supplies and everything. Oh, we got a lot of contaminated junk coming up in here. Why was that? Oh, that's right. We had like a lot of contaminations going on here. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Where are you going? Where are you going? Go back, go back, go back. Uh, why was this? There's a few things I think they really need to update in this game. That's for sure. Like, the staffing situation is a little rough. There's a chance, it came called Genshin Impact. That's nice, but I don't know if you're willing. Uh, you will like it. Other people can join you, but I'm not sure if you can, if they can, if you're in a different country than them. Uh, that'd be kind of neat. Uh, though, that's an MMO. Employees don't wash their hands. Is that what's going on? Do I need a sink or something? I have sinks. I don't know if is. Do you think like is that a legitimate? Is that a joke or do you think that might actually be the it? Because I don't think there's a way for them. Like, is it? Does it matter on their cleanliness? Hold on. Let's speed up the process. Wait to see if they do it again, and let's look at their cleanliness. Genshin Impact is not is uh uh is not something for you, Shark. Yeah, the uh the MMO side of things looks a little bit tough and all about lollicons yeah oh well hey i'm glad thank you thank you very much for letting me know that that's not something that i'm into you rock glad i don't come across as that i i feel like being a weeb is enough for me all right our, our product isn't as contaminated anymore they say one of the next updates, uh, if I was looking at the update list and stuff that they're going to be working on, and one of the big things they say they're going to work on is getting it so they use their breaks appropriately. Oh, God, they're getting sick from food. Why is that? What is going on here? Is it there? Is it because of your hygiene? Is that what it is? I, they're not apparently using their breaks appropriately, which is causing issues. All right, let's look at our, uh, let's go ahead and look at our laundromat. Our laundromat is... You know what? We have such a supply over here in our laundromat. We may need to upgrade it a bit. All right. We upgraded a little bit of it. So let's go ahead and put in these new things that we have. 
We have a large washing machine, a large dryer, and reading material for customers. Aw, oh, that's delightful. Let's throw one or two of these in here, shall we? There you guys go. Having a little, little spot to wait and do your thing. Uh, do I need to, ex I think I need to expand my, my, my laundromat a little bit, don't I? I'm having a party tonight, need some stuff. I got you covered. Uh, you here, you here. All right. We got stuff being sent out. We'll get a little bit of cash that way. We're going to now go ahead and build a little bit more laundromat here. Oh, hold on. Oh, stop. Oh, well, that works. All right, there we go. Having a party night, need some stuff. Nope, sorry, can't help you. Not able to do much of that. So, hey, what's up, Donner? How goes it, sir? All right, let's move some of the, uh yeah we're gonna move the bench for a second so we got these new washing machines which look exactly oh they're just larger i see oh i like that i like this idea look at that that looks pretty good what if i do washer washer dryer dryer and we'll do it again here washer washer dryer dryer down a few benches for them to sit and watch their stuff go Put another little magazine stand for them there uh pretty freaking depressed and awful i'm sorry bud just hey just listen i can tell my other friends it'll pass give it some time try not to do anything too crazy just breathe relax hang out watch some streams It'll get better, buddy. I'm sorry. Uh, sorry things are a little rough for you, my dude. Do I like this layout? Uh, it'll do for now. Hold on. There's a way to tell here how much I get per top license purchase all products available. Marketing per bill, marketing business on bill. Marketing business on billboards. <gasps> we should look at that. Evo! Thank you for the resub, buddy. How's it going? How's the Overwatching doing? I'm going to send you back home for now. I really don't need you. Watch Shark's birthday cake, Vaughn. Uh, that should get whoever is depressed uh, back in a good mood. Did you really enjoy that? Did you guys really enjoy that live stream? I hope so, man. Games are really good. That's what we like to hear. Yes, I'm glad. Thank you. I was so worried. We're going to send those guys off to do some things. I want to buy another business license for this place and just keep it going. Oh, no, 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 no. We need uh, we need to continue to upgrade our... Uh, ooh, how much does it cost for a billboard? 20K? I think you know what we need to do. I think... Oh, God, no, because I need to get my, my... I don't think I have enough plant set up. Do I buy... Do I just start another business? Destroying as Orissa? I'm, dude, I'm glad. I'm glad you're enjoying Orissa. You, uh, you play a great tank. Again, is my is the pool table broken? Is that what's going on here? Oh, 
All right, my product isn't contaminated anymore. We love to see that. How's my how's my supply over here? Not bad. Good. Okay. Uh, you know what? I think we start another. Ooh, how much is it? How much is it for a chicken shop? Oh, it's only nine k to buy a chicken shop. I think we start at least one more, maybe donut, uh, franchise. And then we'll uh, we'll move over and start working on the fried chicken once we get that excess profit coming in. What do you guys think? You think that's a good idea? I think it is. I think we do that. Let's look at the land. Oh, I have to purchase land too, though. Oh, this is a nice little sh little spot for a donut shop. <coughs> Excuse me. It might actually have been only wish that you would have reconsidered the salt in the cake. Uh, it might have actually been a good cake. I don't know, dude, because I put like four more cups of sugar than I should have into that thing. Uh, do I want to do this? Do I want to do this? Because then I have to start up new supply lines. Yeah, let's do it. Here we go. We have a business. We're opening up a new business, boys. Oh, it's right on the alleyway, too. It's great. Well, let's get to building. So I'm going to be smart this time. Uh, and we're going to we're going to do this a little bit differently. We're going to work on the restaurant first. I realized the restaurant itself does not have to be that big. More, uh, is more VR videos coming? I can do more VR videos. Absolutely. I'd love to, especially now that I got that nice microphone to use for it. I think I could do that. So I'm going to work on a little storeroom here as well. I go one more on the dining room this way. Because it doesn't have to be big, but it's got to be a little bit. Storeroom doesn't have to be that big either. I have yet to use... Oh, wait, no. The kitchen's got to be rather uh, impressive. Honestly, you know what? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. <coughs> That's all I have to say about that. That's all I was having you guys hold on for. There was nothing else to be said there. Oh my god, what is going on over back at home? Of course, I check and you guys break. I think it's the table. I think the table's broken in full speed. Every time I come back here, this thing is broken. Anywho, so let's see here. We need a storeroom pretty much off of this. Let's make sure we have enough room for what I need to do here as well. Because we're going to need a door... Yep, hold on. Let's go back home. Let me see. Is it the stupid table? It is the table. Look. But if I go in regular speed. He's fine. I'm getting rid of the table. The table's bad. I was the wrong button. Oh, God, what have I done? No, stop. There we go. 
I think we just put in another TV for them here. There you guys go. That's all you get. I can't do it anymore. I can't listen to that noise one more time. Okay, so back over to what we were doing. We need a door here. Because this is going to be the entrance that they use to pick up product. We're going to need a door. I can, ooh, I can actually bring the kitchen this way a bit too. And now we need back in this restaurant. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need a door and a door. Wait, I can put a soda machine out here? Oh, shoot. I did not know that. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. That could be incredibly handy. All right. So, can I go out by two here? I can. All right, so over here, we're going to have address register here and here. We're going to have a soda machine literally right here for them to use. So, bop, they can get their sodas super quick. They can sell their weeds, their salads and stuff there. Uh, Donner, do you happen to have a, uh, a VR game that you rec recommend? I have not played in quite some time. All right, so we have that. Now we need a guest. Oh, God, I forgot about the bathroom for the guests. Oh, where are we supposed to put those? Yeah, sure. Oh, what you got? Lay it on me. All right, there we go. Blade and sword. Ooh, that would be good. I hear the modding in that game is really good. Hey, I can add lights in this. I did not realize that was a thing I can do. Look at that. All right, what's next? Uh, We need... Ah, sure, I'll accept. I need some more money anyways. You Okay, guys, I need you to sell out to that guy. Thank you very much. Get him out there. Plenty of crazy mods. Ooh, maybe I just become a mod YouTuber. You know, one of those ones that just does, like, mo literally, like I said, just moderating. Uh, not moderating. Uh, checking out new mods as they come in. Because they can be pretty cool. They can be pretty wild. All right, then I'm going to have you guys then deliver over here once you're loaded back up. Uh, all right, so we got bathroom, storeroom, restaurant, kitchen. Now we need a little break room for them, a break room, and a bathroom for them.
That'll do there. Perfect. Okay. So we need some doors. So for the bathroom, of course, we need one, two, three. We'll put a little showers in the corner. Uh, we'll put a little hand washing station and a little, little spot for them to dry their hands off. So hopefully that'll help out with their cleanliness. Uh, for the break room, they get, oh God, the break room actually has to be larger than that. Holy heck. I keep forgetting about all the stuff that they need in their break room. First, they need a dishwashing station, which will slap right over here. Uh, they need some counter space so they can actually do some cooking and stuff. So we'll give them a good old cutting board. A coffee machine. A microwave. A trash can for them on the their way out. A little refrigerator action. This is all getting incredibly expensive. All right, so they have their cooking supplies. They have a microwave, a coffee machine, a cutting board. They need a table to sit at, don't they? Like, do they not get a table to sit at? Wasn't there supposed to be a, a kitchen table or something here for them? Am I wrong? Am I crazy? Hi again. Hey, Mbwiber. How you doing? Good to see you, sir. Uh, I guess they don't get tables to sit at in this break room. Excellent. Less that I have to buy. You know what? You guys get some TVs, too. Here you guys go. And then I'll put a little arcade machine over here for you. There you go. That's all you need. Bathroom's back that way. All right. Bathroom. Employee bathroom. Employee break room is done. We need some stuff in the storeroom here. Which we will set here and here and here. Uh, you're all going to be toasted. That's just fine. That's all I'm going to deliver here. I keep forgetting... That my stuff breaks down. Good evening, Mr. Shark. Good evening, Wraith. How in the world are you, madam? Uh, storeroom is pretty much done. I don't really need that much in the storeroom. Storeroom's super easy. Uh, let's work on the dining room. We don't have an entrance to the dining room yet, do we? Hold on. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's make some cut grass here. There we go. That looks delightful. Man, business is good. Uh, we'll do ahead, go ahead and do a little gravel parking lot here as well. Uh, or gravel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do this. Then we'll add a door right here. And then we wait, wait, can I just give the guest the soda machine to use? No, because they do have to buy it in the uh there has to be a transfer of funds for that. Uh we need some dining room tables over here. We'll sit a large table over here. A little chef's kitchen, as they would say. Go ahead and slap these guys over here so I can pump in some more tables. Am I out of money? No, okay. Uh, there we go. 
nice little tiny restaurant for these people. I did not. That cake is long gone and in the trash. Yeah. I threw that thing away so freaking fast. Uh, okay, I think that... Oh, I need a trash can for when they leave. I'll throw one over here for them, too. This is, like I said, real tiny restaurant. It's fine. All uh, right, so that just leaves the piece de resistance, the kitchen. Which I might actually do something a little bit different here. I'm going to move this door over here for reason. All right, so the first thing I want to do here, I want to go ahead and throw one, two, three, four. I'm going to need a bigger kitchen. There we go. All right. Now that we have these down, we need to start working on actually of a little bit of a prep table here. So for that, oh, I need a bigger kitchen again. Oh my God. Who's that? Casino! Thank you, buddy. Appreciate that, my dude. How goes it, sir? Thank you for the resubscriber as well, my man. All right. Again, we're going to work from the back of the house to the front of the house as far as it comes to making things, right? So everything's made here. And then... It's set over to these double fryer. So boom, boom, boom. Can I raise this up a little bit? You know what? Let's make this whole thing a kitchen. There we go. Might as well. So one, two, three. I wish it was just one more wide, dude. Dang it. That's fine. So we got... Maybe we can do something with this. Maybe we can just go one, two, three, four, right into these fryers. Wait, there's a section that needs to happen first before that, which would be... Oh, okay. Yeah, there's... Oh, my God. I hope I have enough for this. Resubscribble. <laughs> I love that. All right. For glazed donuts, we need... Hi, buddy. Hi, ghost. Oh, why are you being so loving today? Uh, Let's go ahead and build, grab a glazing machine. Move these down one. Mixing chocolate ingredients. That goes there. There's one more ingredient I'm going to need later on, but that should be fine for now. Mix here. Boom. You know what I'm going to... Okay, I'm going to do a test run with this restaurant. Here's what I'm going to do. I think we can get away with two night cooks coming in during close. No chefs during the day, just at night. They come in, they make the donuts, it opens in the morning, you get donuts, and you have it sold out. That is a typical thing that you will see in a lot of baking and pastry places. You know, you don't have the bakers there all day long. He kind of goes from front of the house to back of the house. So we're going to go ahead and see if that's something that will work for us here. I never put my soda machine back down, did I? <gasps> oh, I can't put it down there. I might have to go. You know what? I might have to. Hold on. Whip, whip, whip. Uh. 
the pipe. Oh, dude, I love that so much. Hey, what do you guys think about the hay thing? So we have that hay emote. What do you think about it being shaken instead? So it really looks like he's yelling it. You think? I love how this restaurant is just straight up just a brick wall. You think? Okay. Hey, Twisted Pandora. What's up? How you doing? Imblaber. Welcome back again. Uh, okay, so do we have everything? We have break room. We have a bathroom. We have another bathroom. We have a storeroom. We have a kitchen. And we have dining. And I think I have everything in the kitchen done. I've got the fryer. I've got the glazer. I got that good old chocolate donut thingy. Uh, we don't have any windows or anything, which might be necessary for a nice, you know, good looking establishment. So let me go ahead and throw the walls up here. Should I just add windows so people can watch people poop? Oh, I love that idea. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. Okay, so now we need to make it a two-star restaurant by hiring the appropriate staff. Uh, which is always a fun part to do. But I think uh, I think we got ourselves a nice little front restaurant. A, a restaurant. The, the front of the restaurant really looks good, doesn't it? Oh, boy. Uh, all right. So let's go ahead and work on some staffing. First things first is we need to work. Oh, wait. Do we still have schedules set up over here for them? Oh, I need to redo the schedules for these guys as well, huh? Okay. Well, first of all, let's hire some employees. Let's go ahead and pause because it's going to take up some money to do so. Because uh, they're not going to be working and generating a profit right off the bat. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to hire uh, two cleaners. Maybe three. We'll see. Uh, let's look at the scheduling here and let's look at it. They go from 8 to tw uh, from eight to 21. So that would be... So let's say they didn't work any other time, right? All right, so this is the time, 8 to 21. That's 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Up until 21. So that's 13 hours of work. Let's make another one that's doing the same thing. Okay, so these are the sa exact same schedules right now. I need them. I need a cleaner during the entire uh, time. So, oh, I have two stars if I do it this way. So what I need to do, I need to put one on break here, one on break here, one on break here, one on break here. Wait, why does that not work now? But I have, it said, wait, hold on. Wait, no, no, no. Okay, so it says for stars, right? Uh, one of the things I need is a, a cleaner all business hours. There are technically cleaners all business hours this way, isn't there not? While one's on break, the other one is open. There's one already there. Or wait, or do I need a one cleaner to always be working? Are you serious? 
I need one that just never stops working. That doesn't make sense. How do I have it done at the other business shop? As far as cleaners go. I have two different, I have three different cleaners uh, on this one. Well, let's hire one more cleaner. Wait, that shouldn't make any sense though. I am so confused by this. Uh, so I put one on break. Wait, this one can go on break. I can't put this guy on break though. Why is that a thing? Yeah, just the, if you're on schedule one, you do not get a break. That's just how it is. Why is that a thing? Am I missing something? If I have you work an extra hour over this time, can I give you a break then? No, you just can't have a break. Why does that not sound right? Well, I'm sorry. We're going to work one guy to death. Hmm. What if? Oh, wait. You know what it is? Hold on. I know what it is. We got to switch them over to one. And this will work. Look at this. Yep. I'm just incredibly dumb. I have to move them over to the schedule over here. Because right now they were both on zero. Uh, cause it's already, despite the game being paused. There we go. Okay. So that'll work out just fine now. Boom. Boom. It's still a two-star restaurant. We need one more because this guy, can I just have an employee whose only job is to come into work? All right. From eight. The 21. Oh my God. You're going to be a night shift guy, but yeah, you know what? Nah, you've got it easy, dude. You've got it real easy. Your job is simple. You're coming in and you're cleaning up before work starts. So we're going to have you come in, do work, do work. We'll have you take a quick break. No, we'll have you take a quick break here. One, two, three. A quick five-hour shift. You're a part-time employee. That's all you're getting. You are going to specifically be on schedule three. You come in and you clean after the cooks that we're going to have coming in at night. That's all you do. Okay, so there's the cleaners done. Engineer. Uh, how many engineers do I have over here? Two engineers. Let's do it as well. Over here, the engineers are on zero and one. So they work throughout the day, it looks like, and are closed at night. We don't have anyone coming in at night. Okay. So for engineers, uh, again, you're going to be on multiple. You're going to be different schedules. Boom. And workers. And we have six of them over here. Hot dang. I don't. Okay. we're Like I said, we're going to try something a little bit different. We're going to hire... Uh, two workers. These guys are going to be chefs. Their job is specifically going to be the kitchen. So you guys are doing donuts. That's all you do. You do donuts at the, at night. That's all I want from you. So we're going to make a cook's schedule. Try VR, uh, PSO. What is PSO? 
I am unfamiliar with this term, my good sir. All right, so you are going to be the cooks that come in at during the morning. Is VR, uh, is VR psychological horror called Red 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 M T T E? Hey, listen, if you happen to have a Discord, uh, throw that in my suggestions channel, man. All right, so we're going to build one kind of up like this. So we have two and three. So you're going to be two and three. Taking breaks at different times. There we go. So there's always somebody in the kitchen. Uh, that should at least get my supplies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hey, you guys have showers and food and stuff, so you guys can work an extra hour. There we go. All right, so y'all are just chefs. That's all I want you guys to do. 10 out of 10, just do that. All right, so we got the cooks that come in in the morning and they take care of the restaurant. Hopefully that'll be just fine. Red Matter, I wrote it wrong. If Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, Okay, so we got, we got the cooks. Now we need... You know, Wyatt, I'm going to do this before I forget too. Chef hat, uh, chef's outfit. And clean boots. Chef's hat. Chef outfit. You get a knife as well. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't get a knife. You get clean boots. That'll help with uh, protecting against some stuff and things. All right, so the chefs are done. Now we need another worker. Uh, actually, we need two more workers. Y'all are going to run the cash register. That's all I need you to do. You're going to be on schedule one and two. And one more worker who's only here to do orders. Ah, God, I might need another one to do orders, too. I need a night shift guy to do orders. And I need a day shift guy to do orders. Well, I thought we were going to have to... Ch we could chill on our employees, but I don't think that's going to be the case. I thought we could do it with less. But I think 11 is going to be a good uh, set level of stuff. So you're going to be doing... Register, register, and you're going to be running orders as well. You're going to be running orders during the day. You're going to be running orders during the night. And of course, y'all need some stuff. So we'll give you some boots. Uh, you guys don't really need any of that. Wait, can I get... Hold on here. Where is... There's no real, uh, a, uh, there's like no server uniform, is there? No. Shame. So we go back over here. Uh, everyone just gets nice boots. All right, I think that's all I can do right now. I do have to set up a supply chain over here now, though.
Uh, well, we can't sell any donuts right now, unfortunately. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until the place closes to technically open it. And we are open in three, two, one. All right, we're open for business, technically. Let's go ahead and figure out how I want to do this. This place delivers the center lane, which is always full. So I'm also now going to have you deliver to Oak Lane as well. I hope I have enough to, uh, to keep everything supplied. We'll see. Ooh, you know what I need to do? I need to add more storeroom over here, don't I? Look at that. This is what we like to see. Our production is doing really well now, so we can afford to do this. Uh, stuff is getting contaminated again a little bit, but it's nothing too serious. All right, we can deliver some salad over to Sadie. Let's go ahead and get that out of there. Let's go back and see how our donut producers are doing over here. The chefs are in. Wait, what are you doing? Why are you here? What's your name? Nicholas? Nicholas, what do I have you doing? Nicholas is running the restaurant during the night. I have Nicholas running the register at night. That's... <laughs> Dude's got the easiest job I've ever seen. All right, hold on. We got to mess with the schedules again. Gosh darn it. Okay, let's see here. You guys are running orders. Y'all should both be at night. Nicholas, I need you to go... Wait, Nicholas, why are you here at night? Oh, I'm thinking one and two. I'm th I forgot there's a zero. Okay, hold on here. Register people, you're going zero and one. That'll be at night. You will be two and three. Because you're just doing orders at night. No. You're going to go two and one. That way we're during the day. Okay, so we have orders coming in during the night. One orders coming in during the day. Uh, as a cook, you're coming in during two and three. All right. That should do a little bit better. Okay. Go home. My goodness. Have my chef started yet? <gasps> Wait, I can't do sprinkles yet anyways. That's fine. Forgot about that. All right. Make food. Make food. <gasps> I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Me is him dumb. Me is him dumb.
There we go. Honestly, I don't think I am enslaving. I feel like I'm doing pretty good here. I feel like they're, they have a good business going on. Look how happy they are. Yeah, see, I wish what would happen. Okay, so here's another thing that needs change. These guys are full up over here. That, But the thing is, they don't... Uh, they don't stop. Like, if this place is full up, they sit there until it's all unpacked during the night. Which is a little bit of a problem. Ah, oh, shoot. Also dumb. Nope, never mind. We have we have some stock here. So I wish they would like as soon as like they ran out of stuff to place, they we would be able to they'd move on to the next. Or at least the option to let them do that. You know what I mean? Look at this, we got donuts being made during the night. Uh are we gonna have enough to sell later on? Probably not. I might need to get a third chef. Oh shoot. I forgot about this. Hold on. Oh, well. It'll get cleaned out over time. Oh. Hey, what's up, Saw? How you doing, Kraboo? Pleasure to have you here, buddy. Look at that. There we go. Now we're getting some gla we're getting some stuff going on here. I think the smaller restaurant's gonna be nice. But here's the thing: all my chefs leave during the night, so if they don't make enough product, we're screwed. But we'll see how it goes. Now over here, how we doing? How's our contaminated stuff looking? Is it because of hygiene? Is that what it is? Is it because we don't even have enough showers or something? I think it's because it takes them so long to go from here to here. Maybe I make a second bathroom that's just showers near the base, like near here, so they can go in and get clean and then go right back to work. That might not be a bad idea. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, God, it got so quiet there for a second. I swear to God. That was a good one. That was a good one. Hi. Hello, evil. Good to see you, buddy. Oh, look at all these people. Why are they come? Wait, are they coming? In? They, they're coming in through my main door. Can I make this an employee only door? They're coming in looking at all the weed. Oh, I don't have a soda machine up now. Crap. I knew I forgot something. Why don't you guys remind me? Oh, it's broken. There we go. Now it's fixed. Look at this. We got product coming in now. Wait, why do I have two engineers working right now? I don't feel like that should be how it is. Uh, oh, did not like that the police stopped right in front of my door. I don't think that's going to be a problem right now during this one. Just lurking? Yeah, I see. Yeah, just lurking. Just hanging out. Yo, where are the customers at, bro? Here you go. Boom. Damn. 
Look at this money. You want a donut? No sprinkles. Sorry, get out of here. Who do you think we are? Running, uh, running a sprinkle restaurant? Where's the rest of my customers? Oh shoot, we have a uh, we have a big order to do over here, boys. Best get out there and do it. Oh, look at that. Big old big old group. Lots of money. Or big old order, I should say. What you hungry for? A donut? I got you a donut. Here, have a donut. You want a glazed donut? Have a glazed donut. Now, we are running out of product a little bit, but that's fine. This person's saying the temperature's bad in here, so I wonder what happens if I throw in a little bit of a, little bit of a heater. Throw one right here in the corner. Yeah, let's do that. Big old heater. There you go. There you go. Now, shut up about the heat. Lack of de decoration. I wonder if that's the thing that actually matters right now or if that's just something that's going to matter later on. Well, I'm hoping our profits go up from this, but we will see. How's, how's our donut shop going up? Man, now this donut shop is where it's at. Look at this. How many customers? We're getting about 10 customers at a time during the day. We love to see it. If I would have taken the lay the layout that I had over there, moved it over to here, gosh, could have been amazing. I think we only need one chef during the day. I may cut down somebody's hours over here, but we'll see. Yeah, get you a glazed donut. And how we doing back over here? I think if we wait a day or two, we can get our... I think it's almost time for us to get ourselves our own fried chicken shop going on. Where are you going? You're going over there. You're hanging out over here. We got more orders coming in now. We love to see it. How's, how's, this, how's our shelves doing over here? Oh, wow. We are actually cutting down on shelving and stuff over here. We're getting seven customers a day on over in here. Yeah, get you some money and stuff. We love it. I'm excited. Okay, so we're uh, we're about to close down for the day. How did we do on sales? We lost 1200. No, I don't think I feel like we did not actually lose 1200 during that. Ah, we'll find. We'll see what happens. We're going to have to work on the factory again soon. Okay, so we should, if I did my scheduling right, have some chefs coming up on in here. And they should start really... Yeah, there we go. Let's see how full the, uh, the shelves get now. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I hate doing this, but I'm going to do it anyways. I'm going to refresh this. I got rid of a bunch of donuts, but now everything will be nice and neatly organized. Yes, there we go. So you get... Okay, so why are we at least leaving that chocolate donut? Okay, I see. So he takes the chocolate donut, he fries it, 
and then I think he dips it in chocolate afterwards, or does he take the dough? No, he takes the dough. Okay, so he's got choc okay, so he got a chocolate donut out of there. He's gonna dip it in chocolate. He's gonna come back over here. He's going to then hit it with that. And then put it in the fryer. So I have these in the wrong order a little bit. Okay, so what I need to do. Move these over this way. So it's here to here to here to fryer. Let's see if he does it again. Oh, no. What's he going to grab here? He's got a plain donut. Okay. Plain donut goes right into the fryer. Okay. That to there. That to the fryer. And he's good. Chocolate. Nice. Okay. So how does glazed work? Has he done any glazed yet? I want to wait to see how they do that. Okay, so these got to get rearranged a little bit, too. So they go fryer glaze in. So what's this game about? Uh, I have a feeling it's about uh, selling drugs. The idea of this is yes. And the, and the main goal of the game is to sell your primary product, which is drugs. Uh, we call it salad here. Uh, but for the most part, you're not wrong, but you also do have to manage the, the, the front of the restaurant, the actual, like, cause these will make you a little bit of profit selling donuts and stuff. But what's going on in the background is you're selling, uh, different versions of salads over here. How are we looking over at center lane? Okay. Shelves are full over here. We're good. How's my factory looking? Not bad. Not bad at all. We might need to hire somebody who just does loading over here, but I'd have to buy more property for that. Uh, this is where you build your... Uh, this is your main primary residence. This is your factory where everything gets done. These are the ones producing the drugs. Uh, you've got grow rooms. You've got things to dry it out. And it you've got to ship it out to different areas to your local areas and plus just doing basic orders chicken not drugs oh it's definitely not fried chicken i think we've had this discussion see like right there that I just sold one of these products for $422 while wow, these may get me like 12 or 13. My ghost You're being so loving today. I love this. And now look, I, our product is actually starting to move off the shelves pretty well. Oh, it's during the day now. Look, see, there we go. Perfect. Hey, nice stream, bro. Hey, thank you. Appreciate that. Welcome on in. How'd you find the stream, by the way? I'm always curious when new uh, first time chatters come into like streams with smaller viewership just because I mean, Twitch doesn't really recommend videos very much. So I'm always, always a little bit curious. Welcome on in. All right, moving the soda machine up front is a great... Ooh, you know what? We should do that to this area here. Hold on. Do I have enough space to do that? There we go. Let's do that so that it's a little bit faster. Sorry, we don't have sprinkles, guys. Oh, oh my. All my guys are on break. What are you doing? Are you literally just on break? Is that all you're doing? All right, there you go. Chocolate donut, boom, chocolate donut. You want to drink too? Bam, look, it's right over there now. Oh, and another donut and another drink. Oh my God, you love to see it. 
Oh, this dude's got a drug sale going on here. Let's go. We got another order coming in over here. We've got stuff being delivered over. I think we've got a good balance here, boys. Look at this. Look at the money coming in hand over fist. Is that the term? We may need to hire a day shift uh, chef just to keep up with the uh, the orders. We're running out of product, boys. Yes. Okay. Also, hi, Musk. Good to see you, buddy. Oh, you want two donuts? Oh, my God. You're my favorite kind of customer. And a drink. That's going to be like $24. Woo. What you got? Sprinkle donuts? Get out of here. We don't sell no sprinkles. Oh, we should sell sprinkle donuts. Let's do that. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. That would be so good. Don't you think? I found Twitch recommending. Like a treasure. Nice. I need to use that more often. Oh, uh, thank you very much. Uh, okay, I'm going to give one attempt at this, okay? A gooseway. That's not right. That's not right. I take it back. I just wish I, I never would have said that out loud. That's not, that's not how you say it. Oh, boom. Look at that money. Oh, my God. Look at that money. Yo, this is great. What you want? You want weed? Or you want you want some, some crispy salad? There you go. You want a sprinkle donut? Get that out of my restaurant! Who do you think you are? Glazed donut? Here you go. Bam. You want a drink too with that? Give me your money and get out of my house. All right. I think we can afford to upgrade the donut shop. All right, what do we got now? What can I finish this up with? All right. Let's see here. We got some new stuff. We've got a fast double fryer. Okay, hold on. Hold on here. All right, get this out of here. We're upgrading the restaurant. A fast double fryer. You're doing... Uh, I can't remember chocolate oh wait why do i have two chocolate ones that's not right oh that no 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 no. i don't i don't i don't i wait how many fryers do i have i have a why do i only have two fryers you know what get rid of them all get rid of them all we redo it we redo it hold on wait oh there's a fryer here too okay get rid of the glazed one uh put down the fast one All right, you're doing glazed. Uh, you get rid of that one. You're doing chocolate. I'm going to do this individually so I don't mess this up. Uh, you're doing plain. And you're doing, well, you're going to be doing sprinkles now that I have the option to do so, I think is a great idea. Uh, did you ever play a game called Card Shark? Yes, I did. It was a good time. Okay, so we got one, two. We got all four donuts being made in these fast new fryers. Uh, we got some other products here. Uh, we've got a new gla auto glazing machine. So we get rid of this one we put down the auto glazer <laughs> okay then we have a chocolate machine which we have a new auto chocolate machine here so we'll slap that bad boy down here and sprinkle machine we got a little sprinkle station I guess that has to go at the end We'll throw that bad boy there and try that out. Let's see how that works. All right. I think that's going to be fine. I think that's all in the right order. Now, I know I have two glazing stations. Uh, so, I may...
put another one here and you're gonna do just glazed you're gonna do just sprinkled is it expensive yes but we have a kitchen uh on twitch or youtube i played it on twitch uh i had trouble making a good youtube video out of it and that's primarily because of my editing skills more than anything else um but i did enjoy it it was a good time we had the devs in we were chatting it up having a good time all right the chef should be coming in here so the next goal is to upgrade the uh other restaurant too now we have to we have to switch the other one over to being able to run all the product wait oh i'm a three-star restaurant now <gasps> all products available oh i think i also need to be able to wait marketing business on billboards i could really quickly i think if i get 20k i could make this uh a four-star restaurant right now i might try to do that maybe we save up a little bit of cash and see if we can do that well well time to cram out to my old twitch account Ah. Well, I'll be streaming on both for a while here. Man, look at these happy, happy people. I'm, I'm, I love this game just in the fact of like learning has been a lot of fun. Wait, where's the other chef? Don't I have two chefs coming in tonight? Oh, uh, look at him go. Oh, wait, he's going to be able to. Ah, uh, why did you throw that on the floor? Why are you throwing that on the floor? All right, he's got the glazed donut. All right, he's throwing it in the fryer. Let's watch. Okay, so he takes the glazed. They fry, uh, wait. Are you making sprinkles out of that? What is going on here? I'm confused. Okay, so glazed goes on in. All right, you take the sprinkles. Uh, oh, you got to glaze it and then... Oh, I see. You glaze it and then I'm guessing you take it over to the sprinkle station. And you get some sprinkles on that bad boy. And you throw it up on in there. Okay, chocolate donut. Goes into the fryer and I think just gets sold as is. Perfect. Okay, this is actually working really well. Okay, glazed. All right, you're throwing some sprinkles on that bad boy. I love these auto machines are nice because it doesn't take up a lot more of their time. Okay, chocolate donut. Oh, wait, no, sprinkle donuts. It goes there. It goes over to the fryer. Ooh, I might have to... Okay, I might have to change around how these work then because if he's going all the way from here to here... I need this here, this here. Or I could run, I could do it like this. Hold on. So he makes it. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Oh God. I'm so confused. Okay, so what are you grabbing here? You've got a chocolate donut I'm not worried about. Okay, you got glazed donut. Glazed donut goes from the table to the fryer. I already messed it up. Ah, no. Don't you dare sell that. Don't you dare sell that. All right, glazed donut goes from here to the fryer. Okay, no, and the sprinkles go... From the sprinkles to the fryer to the machine to the sprinkle station, which should be over here.
there we go. So it's a nice conga line of stuff. It's a conga line of efficiency. Does it? Do they have to walk ten miles to get around to do so? Probably yes, but it's 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 fine. I could when I get a huge area, I could just like have a bunch of chefs working on one particular product at one point, but I don't see the necess necessity of it. Honestly, we're just trying to get them through the door so that we can sell more donuts and stuff. Wait, is that all we can sell, guys? Oh, wait, is that all we were able to make? I feel like we can hold more than that, right? Like, these hold rows of four. I might have to hire another nighttime chef. Or a daytime chef. Maybe that's what I do. You know what? I'm going to do it. Business is so good right now. I'm going to hire one more worker. You are going to get promoted to chef. And you're going to work during the day. All right. Let's see how much money we made. We made a good considerable amount of money last time. Hopefully we can do that again. All right, we still got product on the shelf over here. We got product on the shelf over here. Things are looking good. Let's go ahead and start selling some of our product out this way. We'll send some cars out to deliver to the local businesses. The factory is the factory is doing really well, actually. What I might do, if that's going to be the case, I might hire... What I might do is just build out over here, continue our storeroom out a little bit, and hire a few more cars for uh, product distribution. Why don't you love me anymore, Shark Keck? Dude, I'm not going to lie. I've been so into this game. I've read everything you've said. And I think I think I've... I think in my mind, I've, re I've read it out loud because I've read what you said. I am sorry. It is good to see you, Surreal. Love you, buddy. I'm taking on that YouTuber mentality of like, I'm not doing this. I forget that there are people watching sometimes. All right, let's see how much money we can make here. No one's coming into the restaurant yet. Oh, so I need to sell. I need to get all kinds of products available all around here. The gamer love is real. The gamer love is real. Shark has issues gaming and talking at the same time on occasion. Gaming and talking, one thing. Gaming, talking, and also talking to the stream. You'd think after so many years, I'd be better at it. Why is What is this guy doing? Are you on break or something? Is that what's going on? Okay, that's fine. I don't need you to just work right off the bat. Dude, we're making so much money. Oh, you want sprinkles? Guess what? I have them this time. Oh, you want another and a plain donut as well? You got it, buddy. And a drink. Hot dang. $24 worth. That's what we like to see. Uh, also, the other thing we need is we need to start working on the other recipes as well. We need to start making some Amazonian uh, quality. We need iceberg lettuce. Seems like you need the shark multitask expansion. Only $49.99. <laughs> You're not, dude, I'll take that DLC in a heartbeat. What is my chef doing? Didn't I have a chef here? Did I not have a chef around? Didn't I hire a chef? Looking for work. What do you mean looking for? Oh, I didn't tell. I just told. My uh, hold on one second.
I can't type and talk at the same time either. That is an issue I have. All right, there we go. Uh, okay, so what I did is I told this man, <laughs> I told this man, hey, come on into work. You're hired. And he gets here. And he's like, what do you want me to do? And then I just left. There you go. All right, start making me some donuts, buddy. Some of my workers are starting to get a little unhappy, and I don't like that. Unhappy workers are not profitable ha workers. Dude, look at this money. This is insane. This is where the game starts getting satisfying. I'm thinking, guys, what we do is before before I end stream, I might end like 10 minutes early as far as gaming goes. And I might switch our new hay emote over to the shaky one. So when we go to raid somebody, it looks really cool. There we go. We got some orders in. How are we doing over here? How's my shelves looking? Good. How's my shelves looking over here? Still packed. Excellent. Why are you a two star? At the Oh, I need to get your license all the way up, don't I? I might just buy that so I can get some more stuff. Dude, I'm so happy that this is working so well. What? How many? Pe how many people? Are, we're getting maximum of seven. Is it because, uh, why are we only getting seven now? Hmm. Hopefully our chefs are able to work really fast tonight. We made, we made 21K tonight. That's not too bad. The hard part is going to be balancing, um, getting all three products over here, which means the regular salad, the crispy salad, and the iceberg salad. Because I don't even have the iceberg salad going yet, I hate to say. All right, the chefs are going in. We're going to go restock this. Hopefully, we can get this done in time. So, I moved the other chef over to a nighttime schedule instead. I don't know if we have enough. Eh, eh we'll see. Tell you what, the place is staying pretty clean thanks to the cleaners. What are you doing? Why are you? Oh, you're on break now. Got it. I should not let them have a break if they're only on an eight hour schedule. Boys, I think we're one step away from opening up our fried kitchen. Fried our definitely not fried chicken restaurant. I'm excited to being able to open up our restaurant. Hopefully, we can get 24-7 restaurants. That's the goal. That is going to be a fun restaurant to try to try to manage in min-max. <laughs> That's a tongue twister. What did I even say? Dude, we can barely keep up with our donut sales as is. This is nuts. I might need to get the chefs to do, uh, I might need to get four chefs each run, running their own, uh, type of donut or maybe split them to where the one's doing just plain and, oh, ooh, no, two chefs running glazed and sprinkles, one chef running chocolate and plain because those take the less steps, but I don't know. We, I mean, we have two more hours and we've got a pretty good stock of donuts up. I mean, you got to wait until after today because your cook wasn't ha stocking half the more. That's a very good point, too. I didn't even think about that. God, you're so big brained. Is 
Dude, imagine if this is how it really worked, where a chef made one single donut at a time every time. All right, looks like they're leaving for the night, and the other chef should be coming in to take over, and hopefully he'll be able to restock everything. Dude, I'm excited to get the other donut restaurant going properly then. Oh, look, we're already making weed cells or salad cells. I would never work as a criminal, man. I'll never be able to use code words or like a PI or anything I wouldn't be able to do. My goodness. Yeah, look at these guys. One donut. You want a drink too? You should get a drink too. Yeah, boy. Oh, that's what you like to see. Do I need another cash register? I think I need another cash register down. Maybe that's why I can't get enough customers. Maybe I need just more customers. Look, non-contaminated stuff. It's clean. It's looking good. We don't have to min-max yet. See, a lot of these guys want the more expensive salads. I just can't seem to offer it yet. What I might start doing is if we go back to our factory, let's look. Yeah, we've got such a such a big amount of product over here. What I might do. Uh, there's no real reason yet until we get the third product. There's no reason because we won't get four star product. We'll only actually make less money by getting product everywhere it needs to go. So we're going to go ahead and wait on that. What I should do is I should upgrade this restaurant a bit. Oh, that's going to be difficult, but I think we can do it. If I bust this down to open up a little area over here, we may be able to get this restaurant to what I to what I need it to be at. I, it's doing great on its own anyways. How many customers do we get over here a day? 11. And over here, we only get 8. I wonder if it's because of the size of the dining room or the fact that I only have two. Wait, I don't have two cash registers over here, too. Is it the tables offered? What's going on here? Hi, Grace. Good to see you, madame. How are you? Okay, we are keeping up with our stores now. That's nice. Having the chef work when he's, when he's working now the whole day through is just fine. All right, let's have these guys deliver out here. Let's go ahead and get a little bit more money going. All right, I need to switch these guys up because these guys, this guy's offering more money. So we're going to go there first. Not bad. Birthday is tomorrow, but we're doing dinner tonight. Oh, well, happy early birthday. I forgot that we, uh, we share a birthday month. Heck yeah. I hope you have a wonderful dinner and I hope this next year for you is fantastic. Got good things going for you and I hope they only keep getting better for you. I wish I could move these into here. Uh, we do. I'm sorry I missed the birthday stream, but as a late birthday to you, as, uh, but a late birthday. Happy birthday to you, too. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'll tell you what, man. It was a good birthday. Um... Wait till you see the YouTube video that's coming from it. From it. It's going to be so good. We had a really fun day. We celebrated it. Well, I, I technically did a celebratory birthday stream the next day. Woo. Man, it was fun. I should save.
Look, at $31,000, $3,200. I'm going to reject these until these guys get their stuff sold out of here. What I might do... Okay, we I think we start the fried chicken restaurant just to have a fried chicken restaurant. Uh, and then we will have it set up for later on to where it actually like makes money for us by, you know, selling our product. But we do a fried chicken restaurant because I think it's been way too long since it's happened. And then we will work on purchasing a crap ton of uh factory space not for the factory itself but specifically so we can hire more employees i should maybe do a stream that would be fun do it what's that put on my little house slippers combat barbie got me for christmas there we go oh that's nice and toasty all right chef Ooh, the chefs are gonna have their work cut out for them today look at this Don't worry. We'll get the st the stores stocked back up. We love to see it. $33,000, man. I'm telling you. Construction site. site. Uh, ooh, you know what? You have plans uh decrease construction shop, room buildings, and doors and windows. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and buy that. Oh, it's, oh, it's only by... Mm, I wish I would have known that. I forgot you got to continue to upgrade it. All right, we're going to wait to do any more of that. That's dumb. I mean, it's not dumb. It makes sense. I like it. Uh, it's just I, I'm dumb for not realizing that it would be something that you had to continually upgrade to save money over time. I could technically work. You know what? I could technically do a fried chicken restaurant right now. Take snap on it. One second. Bet. Can do. Absolutely. <laughs> ah, I really wish I wouldn't have bought that construction site yet. Ah. Let's look at plots. Let's look at where we're going to put our land. That's a big... We can, we can splurge a little bit on some land, right? What's some... Oh, my God. Why is that so expensive? All right. I can't even... I can't even use these plots of land for what I want to. The most... What's the biggest one I can get? Where's our fry... Oh, my God. There it is. Yeah. That one. Pine Street. Wait, 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 wait. Wash... Washington Avenue or Pine Street? Pine Street big. Pine Street real big. Hey, oh, it's nice to, uh, nice to be back. What are you playing? Hi, Warriors. Good to see you, buddy. This game is called Definitely Not Fried Chicken. The idea of the game is very simple. Let me give you a quick tour. We have these restaurants over here, right? It's a sim game. You manage restaurants. You, you manage the staff, their schedules like you would any other game. Uh, as far as the sim genre goes, you make sure they have their needs met and stuff and you're trying to make some money off of it. So we have two donut shops I've built right now currently selling and we have a laundromat over here. But the thing is, most of these uh, businesses are just front because over here we have a factory selling illicit and bad drugs or like, well, not drugs, salad. They're salads. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, so over here is where we have a shipping station building all these illicit goods and they're being shipped out to our restaurant. And if you look over here, we have a little storeroom 
where every now and then a person may come up being like, yo, can I get a donut? Can I get a drink of water or something? Or, yo, can I get some detergent? But other times I'll be like, yo, give me some real, give me the goods. Give me, yeah, like this guy. See, instead of using the laundromat, he comes in and he grabs a little bit of crispy salad and leaves. And the idea is managing all of this at the same time. So right now we're kind of in the middle of a waiting game. We're letting we're letting our, our places build up some income for us before we do anything else. So we just got to wait. See, these guys buy $422. While regular orders will get me like anywhere from like $14 to $26. So there you go. $24, $12. A little bit of cash hither and thither, but for the most part. And also you'll get these people who are trying to call in orders. So I have some cars on re on wait, ready to send stuff out to try to get them some money there. Yeah, and it's just constantly getting, you get more money, you upgrade, you get more money, you upgrade. It's, it's a really good time. I've really been enjoying this. If I'm playing, I would buy the smaller land and build my way up to the biggest. That's not a bad way of doing it either. Uh, but as a content creator, I feel like I need to, I need to go a little overboard on some of my stuff. Yeah, here you go. Give me that money. $422 out the window. We take it. We take it. Content? Yeah, we sell content here. It's Well, it's definitely not fried chicken. You know what? Okay, here's what we do for now. We, it, like he said, we're going to slowly build up. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and buy our first license. And we're going to go ahead and be a licensed chicken dealer. Or chicken... Oh, wait, we can't even... Oh, they don't take weed at this restaurant. Oh, we have to make a... We've got to make a rock candy lab. Okay, this is where things get interesting. Oh, this is going to get expensive. I might have to just let this game run for a little while. Oh, look how dirty this place is, man. Don't I have you guys wearing boots or anything? I mean, is anything getting contaminated? No, so we're fine. Rock candy. Is that what the kids are calling it nowadays? Hey, this is what we're calling it. It's definitely not for chicken. Dude, you've got your timing back, bud. He's a smooth criminal. Yeah, boy. How much is it for land back at base? Hold on. Because I need to buy up a lot of just land. I don't know if we're going to be able to get both of these in time, but we're going to try. Only the Sith deals rock candy and in absolute. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, why is this place so dirty? Get it clean. Well, I mean, at least they're not. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. So. I know I said I was going to work on the chicken restaurant, but I need to buy a lot of property because the way it works in this game, if you look here, I only have, uh, I have eight out of eight employees hired. And the only way to get more employees is to buy more land for every plot of land I buy. I get two more employees so, and it really doesn't work out the best. Oh, you're going to get sick off of that. Yeah, you are. Um, so I just got to, that's just, I, <laughs> 
Is what I'll, you know, you know, I really couldn't put it any better than that. If you guys didn't understand that, I mean, honestly, this channel's too uh, high education for you, and I need you to just chill. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead and slowly purchase land off of what we got. Bam, I bought more land. Uh, next, I'm going to buy this land for 12.5 uh, on the next day. And I can turn these into roads and stuff. Bro, speaking enchanted table language. <laughs> All right, that's good. Oh, that's real good. All right, throwing some stuff away. Uh, oh, did we, are we going to deliver to them in time? I think we are. Good. Uh, you're going to deliver here and here. But I want to make sure you get there first. Perfect. We made another thousand dollars there. All right. Well, they cleaned up the rep, the place enough. I have two more, uh, I have two more employees now that I can spend, but I'm not going to spend them on this yet. I'm just going to continue to buy, uh, more property. And we're going to continue selling our, our stuff out everywhere we need to go. I contacted the devs asking if they would they could give me a, a build of the game to where I can, like, really, like, I could, like it's kind of like cheat Cody. So I can make YouTube videos and tips and tricks on this. But uh, they, my message went unread. Not a bad profit of a day, guys. Not bad at all. Hi, ghost. What's up, buddy? Why are you being so cute today, huh? Okay. He's mad. Look at all the donuts we have now. Hot diggity dang. Wait, are we open? Oh, we're already open. We're ready for business again, boys. I might need another, I know my, again, I may and or may not need another, oh God, why is it so dirty? Can you do your sling blade? I, I, you know what? I don't know if that, is that, a, is that, what is that a sling blade impression? Ironically, fun fact, I've always just done the thing, but I've never actually watched, I, is, is the movie called sling blade or is that a character in a movie? Your janitor lacking just a little bit. I think he's just off work. I think it's my schedule's lacking. Or do you would? That see, I use that as my thinking voice now. When I need to think and not let you guys know what I'm thinking, works every time. Uh, I'm having a party night. Uh, I need some stuff. I got. I got you. I'm here. Yeah, I'm going to get you on over there. You get over there and we'll get you some money. Right, chicken. That's about all I got. Okay, hey. restaurant's running great. I'm just collecting money. I'm just getting more employees because then I have to make a fried chicken restaurant and then I have to make a rock candy uh, factory, which is going to be great. We're going to have a great time. How many stores do you have? I only have three fronts at the moment. We're switching priority targets over to this one and then these these don't take time this one has a time limit so i need to make sure i get over there in time speaking of which let's see laundromat uh your storeroom is doing really well donut shop over here we still got some good stores where's you're good over there perfect I'm excited to work on this next factory, man. Unfortunately, it takes a lot of employees to run.
Ah, oh, this is so good. This is such a satisfying game. Half the time, it's just sitting here watching your employees do all your work for you, but... I think I could do this IRL. Seems pretty easy. Ghost went quiet, and he scared me. Don't become a chicken drug deal. Listen, it'll be great. It'll be a good time. I don't know what you're talking about. I can do it. Look how easy it is. What you have? You, what you have something against fried chicken? I see what it is. That's fine. We can leave that part aside. Dude, give me that money. Actually, I do. That's fair. Well, that's okay because this is definitely not fried chicken. The whole title of the stream. Have you watched the World Cup? No. I uh I do not really care for 95% of sports. I hate to say. Meat phobia? I think that's just agoraphobia. Agoraphobia. Uh, what was I gonna say? Uh, yeah, the thing I man, I have one distinct problem with sports. Uh, and that is simply where I've always been a gamer and I've enjoyed I've kind of enjoyed the esports side of things as far as like Call of Duty and stuff goes and Counter-Strike. Here's the thing. At least in, <laughs> in, in most video games uh the maps change. If in real life if the football field changed or the soccer field changed or the rules of how to play changed the shape of the ball something to where every year or every couple of years the players had to adapt and you know when they went to practice whether it be football baseball or whatever if they went and what they had to practice was not the same thing that's been done for a hundred of years but they had to go oh shoot this changed the shape of the field changed we need to learn and come up with new practices and come up better. So where, because like the whole thing right now, especially with, I know football is a big thing where like they've started marketing the practice and stuff. Like they go and they show them training and all the, and the drafts and stuff. And the biggest thing is like, they don't show the heart. Like I would love that if like half of the time they were trying to like figure out how they were going to strategize against the new map or the new shape of the ball, or the different rules, or the new contact stuff that they have to do. Like, stuff like that. Man, sports would be so good, but it's the same thing every year. Every year! The only thing that changes is the players. All right, I'm done. I'm sorry. I blacked out for a second. What were we talking about? It was definitely not fried chicken. I can buy another piece of land. I'm going to buy another piece of land. That's all I'm doing right now. Every day I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go over here and get myself a piece of land. All right, let me in here. Let me go and get that one. Now one. Now one. I'm gonna go in and get that one. That one right here. Mm -hmm. That's not good. Uh, twelve thousand five hundred purchase. Another piece of land in my possession. Then I'll buy. I'm just gonna continue to buy. I'm going to buy... How much is it going to cost for the next one? This one is going to be... No, I want this one. This one's going to be 13000 oh, I have enough to buy it now, but I'm not going to worry about it. And it gives me four more employees.
Oh God, I don't know how I want to do this anymore, man. Like I gotta, I might have to, like I said, I might have to leave the game going for a certain amount of time, buy a bunch and redo the whole facility. Cause now I'm going to be making rock candy and Amazonian stuff as well. Which is going to require a good bit more stuff. Again, but we are selling things hand over fist still. Oh, why am I only selling to eight people at a time? Is it because the cash register is not... Because I can't get a bigger line? Is that what's going on here? I'm going to sell this table. I'm going to sell this table. See if I can get a bigger line going. Because usually they can go three. Oh, uh, they are going three deep. I don't know. Oh, maybe it's efficiency. Maybe I just need another. Uh, maybe I do need another cash register to run people through faster. Or a better scheduling system with my, uh, my servers. The register runners. I like how they wait in line here when there's a cash register open here. That would be a nice little feature for them to add to where the customers spread out and don't wait in one single line. Dude, that money though is nice. Ah, uh, well, I am running out of time here, boys. I think I might go ahead and let the game, uh, I might stop the game here. And I think the next time around, uh, we might be able to both maybe make a fried chicken restaurant to start and also upgrade the facility and start really working on some really cool stuff. Gonna sell over to this guy make a quick buck real quick both cars are going out to do that i like the little dispatch thing that we got going on here now that we have everything like really nice and calm and clear and all all balanced to where my my employees aren't dying and stuff i think we could literally uh i i think it's time we mess that up and redo everything and then try to rebalance it again. Oh, we hit 20k again. Look at that. All right, I'm going to save one more time and we're going to call it here. Uh, stick around, guys. We're going to do a quick raid if you guys are interested. Uh, my regulars who know now or her, who now know our raid call will be able to show you what it's going to look like. All right, let's go ahead and find somebody to raid real quick because I got to get my butt into work. Also, Evil, thank you for the 10 bits, bud. Appreciate that, my dude. All right, who is currently doing the video games today? Anyone else playing? Definitely not fried chicken. Are they just starting? Hold on, let me see something real quick. Oh, they're sitting around my side of this. Hold on. All right, we're going to go check out Ooh, little VTuber action. I like it. Let's go check her out. Uh, if you guys do not mind, we're going to go raid another person playing Definitely Not Fried Chicken. They look like they're kind of just starting off as well. Uh, so if you guys want to go check them out, let's go ahead and do it. We're going to go raid Rummy the Boss. Let's go check out their channel. 
If you guys don't know our raid call, it's very simple. It looks a, it looks a little like, one sec, this. Boom. So if you guys want to go ahead and throw that over their way, I would really appreciate it. If you're not sub to the channel, just throw a little O slash or a shark raid. I would really, really appreciate it. Let's go make a good first impression. Thank you guys so very much for watching tonight. I hope you guys had a great night. Mama Shark, I love your face. Mod Squad, thank you for keeping the chat clean and clear. Subs for your continued support. And everyone for your company. I hope you guys had a great night. And I will see you all tomorrow in the next stream. Thank you so much for hanging out. I'll see you guys soon. Stay awesome. Much love. Shark out.